SVG's Jason Dackman, we are at the Sports Graphics Forum in New York City, and I am with this year's chair, Tim O'Shaughnessy of ESPN. Tim, we really appreciate everything that you've done for this event. It's been a pleasure working with you, putting this thing together. Yeah, I know. Thank you. It's been a pleasure to spend time with you guys, especially with you, right? We've, we've spent a lot of time planning uh, and plotting to make this a great day for the community, and I feel like we're on our way. I like to think so. Yeah, we have a good turnout, and the programming has been just phenomenal so far. I want to hear from you what you were hoping to achieve with this year's event. Why do you think that this event is important to the industry, and, and how are you trying to put your own stamp on it? Yeah, yeah, this is pretty simple. Uh, obviously, this is the first time we've been back in a few years. The last time this community was together was pre-pandemic, right before everything shut down. So this is, you know, sort of a touchstone moment for this community. But in terms of what we wanted to accomplish for this conference, it was just kind of going through the bullet points that SVG has uh, given me over the years, which is building community, um, building out a peer network, and trying to make that as expansive as possible, informing me on what's happening trend-wise or amongst my peers at different networks, influencing how I operate internally back at ESPN, and educating me to evolve my workflows. So once I, I kind of listed those things out, it was very obvious that this would be the message for the conference, evolve together as a group, build out your community, rely on your peers, they are not your competitors, and uh, learn how to do better work and enjoy it a lot more. So I think that's the message that we've set out today. Uh, it seems to be working so far, and you know we set out a challenge to everybody to network and meet at least five new faces. Uh, I think we've I think we've hit that mark. Yeah, yeah, I couldn't agree more. And you know, uh, we run a lot of events at SVG. No question, we have a, a lot of uh, verticals that we try to inform and, and grow their peer networks. But I mean, this community, the graphics and creative community, is is about as unique as it gets. Uh, you know, what has it been like over the years creating those relationships, creating that community? And you, you said it before, just seeing the people that you know in the industry on a show or on a shoot really, really kind of helps you, uh, you know, ben both benefit mutually. Yeah, I know. Honestly, um, there's a lot of pride in the work that we do individually, and there's a lot of privilege in doing that work, but that all gets amplified when you realize that you're part of a bigger fabric of people who are doing a similar thing. We all have the same uh, struggles. We all have the same celebrations. Um, we're really in it together, and we influence each other, you know? Uh, there's no doubt that everybody who's a creative leader at any network is a huge influence on me and that our work is influential on the work that their teams do. So that makes you realize it's bigger than you, it's bigger than the company you work for. It's, you know, you're part of something that's just a little more interconnected and that's a, that's a very uh, lovely privilege to have. Well, it's good to hear. And Tim, I can't tell you how much of a privilege it's been working with you on this. Really happy with the event. Wow. And I uh, can't wait till next year, man. It's going to be a good one after we're done with this one in the can. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I started planning it already. So, uh, no, no, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll get uh, one day at a time, Jason. One day right. at a time. For more news from the Sports Graphics Forum, stay tuned to sportsvideo.org and the SVG YouTube channel.